through the good times and bad. This is NES A to Z. Oh boy, with Destiny of an Emperor. Hey, Shueisha, that's, uh, that's the company that, uh, licenses uh, Shonen Jump and stuff. Huh. Yeah. I'm surprised they're, uh, in this yeah, Capcom English also. version of the game. I'm really happy this isn't a Koei game. Yeah, it, from the title, it seems like it would be. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, I think this is an RPG. Pretty sure I played this. Well, I mean, you can tell already. Yeah. But... Okay. I don't actually. Just, uh, game start, I guess. I guess that there was already a uh, file. All right. Well, whatever. Um, maybe I played this a long time ago and just named it that. <laughs> um. Well, I mean, yeah. G. Dogu. That's That'd be fine. That's yeah. Japanese. Sure is. Dogu. Okay. We must continue the history yep. of Gigi Nice, looks really cool. It looks like Dragon Warrior. The Wait, warrior born on different you know what this really looks like to me? It's Saint Seiya. Probably isn't, but... Yeah, I mean, the, the, in localization, they probably wouldn't change it to something Japanese. You know? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't know, I mean, if, I just buy Shueisha, so I kind of feel like it's probably a manga or something. Oh, yeah, probably. To the west. Tao Kian. So Chinese. Mm. Uh, okay. Thanks. So it's like Dragon Warrior or something. Yeah, you start with your bros. So right, you're Louis, Louis, Louis Bay. Liu Bay. Liu Bay. Liu Bay. And we got Guan, Guan Yu. Right, I'm Bay. surprised they even bring this over to America. And Zhang Fei. I mean, it's an RPG. I mean, Chinese movies have been... You know, kind of popular in America. Okay, yeah. but I mean, RPGs aren't popular, and yeah. this kind of thing, I don't know. It doesn't really seem like it caught on yet. Well, there aren't many of these. Yeah, that's true. I've heard of your aspiration. I'm no warrior, but a simple merchant. Uh, ah, cool. What a nice guy. It's a good thing I just talked to people. Thank you. And wow. a thousand... Oh, yeah. I think you, like... It's like an RPG, except you battle with, like, armies. Interesting. Yeah. Surprise, this isn't by Koei. So let's see if we can run into a battle. It's so adorable. <laughs> I wonder if they're. It's like Final Fantasy, there. but you move fast on the world map. Yeah. And you can just walk over mountains. Okay, well, let's see what's in here. Alright. Hi. Hi, right, home of Tao Quinn. Alright. Okay, cool. Let's see what's up here. I gotta battle somebody. Maybe this is a bad place. Oh! oh! <laughs> you would look fool. You can. Threaten us with such a small force? Right, they're gonna crush you in one breath. Alright. What? So, uh. I would see. battle all out. Report on Zhang Liang. Okay, you get to see all your right, enemy cool. stats. Not much of anything. Alright, let's see our tactics. There's no. Ta you have no oh, tactician. We need a tactician. Alright, let's see what happens when we battle. Let's get these rebel forces. Actually, I'll, I'll, I will battle him. Yeah, have your guys fight the rebel forces. Yeah, let's see what happens. Took heavy damage. Oh. Uh, Jeez, so, so your health is represented in your soldiers. Oh, uh, that's kind of neat. Uh, it's also kind of morbid. Yeah, I like it because it's a way to simulate an army game without having it being like a boring army game. Yeah. You know? All uh, <laughs> Holy moly, this is this is awesome. We're getting our asses Yeah, you probably though. shouldn't have fought these guys. Well, wait. If Guan Yu and Zheng Fei can beat the rebel forces, they can help out Liu Bei. Yeah, it's true. Okay, wait, wait, wait. No, okay. Let's all go for this rebel force. Let's see what happens. This is a lot slower. Ah, I mean, see, you're thinking like a tactician, like a true general. Yeah. You know? Except. Alright, guys, if we beat the surrounding armies, we can all gang up on the commander. Mm, pretty much. Oh, jeez. This isn't gonna work out. Jing Lang's too strong. I should have got some weapons and stuff. Uh, we do so little damage. I should probably make. Guan Yu. It seems like he's focusing on Guan Yu. Maybe Guan Yu's really powerful. Or maybe Guan Yu's weak. It'd be cool if, you know, they fight the weaker person. That's smart of them. Let's see. If, they, if he goes for... No, okay. Yeah, we're not gonna get out of this alive. Uh, I like how the really files are called like... histories. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Zheng Fei doesn't really look like a soldier. Or, I mean, doesn't really look like a general commander guy. You know, this game really makes me think they sh really should have had, like, 
you know, a Revolutionary War RPG. Where, you know, it's like a turn-based RPG. You that play as George Washington. Yeah, that would have been awesome. And, you know, you go through America's history, maybe. Uh, okay, well... I mean, I just I envy stuff like Dynasty Warriors, where... All of their historical figures get to, like, fly around and be badass. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, or... Oh, at least you get to start over, yeah. I guess that's also, like, Dragon Quest. Okay. Well... I mean, we're not gonna... We're probably not gonna get that far in an yeah. RPG on this, so, um... Yeah, this has been NES A2Z with Destiny of an Emperor. That's um, a neat little game. If you like RPGs and Chinese history, we'll catch you next time. Yeah, it seems, seems alright.